Thanks, Chase. Last night at the DNC, Wisconsin delegates cast their votes for Kamala Harris and Tim Waltz in a ceremonial roll call. The event was not without a memorable moment when Governor Tony Evers took the mic. Newswatch 12's Jeremy Fredericks joins us now from Chicago with more. Jeremy, what happened last night? Good evening, Jake. We are in the Wisconsin delegates section of the DNC at United Center here in Chicago. Last night, Governor Tony Evers, surrounded by delegates wearing cheese heads, was on the mic to announce the support of the Harris Walls ticket when this happened. It was during a ceremonial roll call where each state cast their votes for Vice President Kamala Harris and Governor Tim Walls. 94 votes for, 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 oh, oh, where are we at? Former Wisconsinite. Former state, oh my God. Our next president of the United States of America. Kamala Harris. Evers was casting the Wisconsin votes, one present and 94 for Harris when he got tripped up. At one point, the Wisconsin Democratic Party chair Ben Wickler led a chance supporting the governor. As you can see, he eventually got it out. Folks inside the United Center took note. I was standing right behind Tony Evers, and I think it really is, you know, he's a great governor. Um, and he just got lost on his piece of paper there, it looked like. But uh, we recovered. The delegates chanted Evers' name during the moment. Evers made light of the situation online Tuesday night. He wrote on X that, quote, sometimes the jazz gets the best of you. That's a reference to him frequently saying he's jazzed as hell. And Evers is not on the speaker's list tonight, but the Wisconsin delegates will be proudly wearing their cheese heads. Reporting at the DNC in Chicago, Jeremy Fredericks, Newswatch 12. All right, Jeremy Fredericks, thanks so much.